If you've upgraded from Photoshop CS4 or older, I'm about to save you weeks of correction time using the Content-Aware Fill feature added in Photoshop CS5. I've saved a selection for you in this image, and you can load that by going to your Select menu at the top of the screen and choosing Load Selection. In Load Selection, you should see a channel called Boy. Simply click OK. There, you'll see the marching ants. Yes, that is the technical term for these little flashing lines around the area I loosely selected with my lasso tool. Now, go to your Edit menu and choose Fill. When you fill, it should default to Content Aware. If not, you can click on Use and select Content Aware. Simply click OK. Photoshop has a very sophisticated algorithm that compares the surrounding image data and makes up new information. It's unbelievable. I can choose Select Deselect to get rid of the marching ants, and there's barely any evidence of this child in the image. So just imagine you wanted to use this rock as a background or a texture. Now we have a pure rock with no child on it that we could use any way we'd like. Let's take a look at a second way to use this. I've got several images in the Lesson 2 folder so that you can practice on your own. We'll start with the first one. So I went down to Mini Bridge and simply double-clicked to open the baby wings. And I'll go to View, Fit on Screen to zoom in. In this shot, there's wrapping paper and distracting stuff. So again, I've saved a selection for you. You can go to Select, Load Selection. You should see a channel called Paper. Click OK. Once you see the marching ants, go to your Edit menu, choose Fill, and click OK on Content Aware. Boom! All the paper is magically gone, and if I choose Select, Deselect, it even perfectly matched up the seams and the texture of our hardwood floor. Now let's take a look at one final way to use this content aware, but I'm astounded every time I try this at what an excellent job it does getting rid of objects I don't want in a photo or cleaning up parts of an image. So in this shot, I will hit Command-0 or Control-0 to fit in window instead of choosing View Fit in Window. Then I'll go to the Lasso tool. This is how I made the selections in the other two images. With the Lasso tool, you do not need to be precise. I'm simply clicking and dragging, being very loose about it out into the dark gray area because there's no image data there. When I let go, after dragging all the way around these wires, it makes the marching ants or my selection. And again, I'll choose Edit Fill, Leave it on Content Aware, and click OK. Boom! It's gone instantly. Select and deselect, or Command D on the Mac, Control D on Windows, will show you a much more gorgeous photo without the distraction of those wires that ended up in the shot. Give Content Aware Fill a try on your own.